Hello everyone. Hope all are doing well. In today's session, we are going to discuss about an important event occurring in the month of April. Yes, we are going to talk about the World Earth Day, which is celebrated on 22nd April. So, only the day 22nd April is counted as World Earth Day. But if you see the serious conditions around in the environment, every day is expected to be celebrated as World Earth Day. And that's indeed a need. Now, let's see all the facts which are related to this World Earth Day. Right from the facts behind it to the reason that why exactly it is celebrated on 22nd of April. So, without wasting time, let's start the session. Earth Day will be celebrated by the millions of people around the world on this Friday, that is 22nd April 2022. This day will be marking the 52nd anniversary of the very first Earth Day which was celebrated in the year 1970. Now, let's see the reason that why exactly the day 22nd April was chosen as World Earth Day. In the year 1969, at a UNESCO conference which was held in San Francisco, peace activist Mr. John McConnell proposed a day to honor the earth and the concept of peace. That is to be first observed on the March 21 in the year 1970. March 21st was the first day of spring in Northern Hemisphere. Now, this day of nature's equipoise was later sanctioned in a proclamation written by Mr. McConnell and it was signed by the Secretary General Youth Han at the United Nations. A month later, United States Senator Gaylord Nelson proposed the idea to hold a nationwide environmental teach-in on April 22nd in the year 1970. And this is how the journey of celebrating World Earth Day started by marking the day April 22nd. Now, let's see why this World Earth Day is so important. Though everyone knows the reason behind it. Everyone knows that due to the insane human activities, the Mother Earth is facing many issues. Not only Mother Earth, but even we humans, because of our careless activities, are facing many issues. As we all know that, the pollution which we cause in our day-to-day -day life, it is depleting the layer of ozone around the Earth, which is the protective layer for us. Let's see, why exactly is it important to us? Earth has long challenged human minds to observe and reflect. Just by our mere inspection or observation of a planet, we gain important knowledge of science and of ourselves. And it's safe to say that nature has a powerful way of teaching us wisdom and also healing us. But the planet is also truthful about the consequences, the result of all the insane, irresponsible activities which are carried by the humans. Accountability is a part of humanity and our actions have an impact on the living things as we share this Mother Earth with the other living creatures as well. The more knowledge we have, the better choices we make in our actions and lesser will be the harm which we do to the Mother Earth and the environment. Now, let's see what is the theme of the World Earth Day for the year 2022. As we all know that World Earth Day will be having a distinct or a different theme every year based on the crisis faced or based on the situations which we are facing. Now, let's see what is the theme for the year 2022. The theme for the Earth Day 2022 is investment or invest in our planet. Focusing on the effects of the climate change, you can see the global warming on the planet that we all share and what efforts are being made in the real world to mitigate it. 
in keeping with the theme earth day 2022 will center on the accelerating solutions to combat our greatest threat that is climate change and to activate every individual that it can be the government the citizens and the businesses to do their part and that was announced by the unesco as like it is said that keeping the environment safe or keeping the mother earth safe is not the responsibility of a single person each and every one who is surviving on this planet earth should be responsible for it and that's what the theme is concerned with we need to activate everyone right from the government to the every individual citizen and also the businesses which are carried out on this planet earth this is the movement to change it all the business climate the political climate and how we take action on the climate now it is the time for the unstoppable courage to preserve and protect our health our families our livelihoods together together we must invest in our planet and thus because a green future is a prosperous future we need to act boldly we need to innovate broadly and implement equitably it's going to take all of us all in that is everyone's involvement is expected and necessary the businesses the governments and the citizens everyone accounted for and everyone accountable let's make a partnership for the planet and let's make our mother earth a safer place for everyone to survive and while there is still time to solve the climate crisis time to choose both a prosperous and sustainable future like see when we are thinking of making our future prosperous there might be n number of ways which may somehow exploit the nature and indirectly the mother earth but such prosperity is not expected when you are thinking of a prosperous future you should also think that it should be sustainable for the coming generations it should not be by the means of exploiting the natural resources available on this planet earth and thus what it is said that when you are thinking of a prosperous future you should also think that it should be sustainable and time to restore the nature and build a healthy planet for our children and their children time is short and that's why there is a requisite to take the actions quickly let's not waste the time and be responsible from this moment itself yeah Mahatma Gandhi said that the earth has enough for everyone's need but not for everyone's greed whenever we are talking about earth we call it as our mother earth as like our mother mother earth has everything to provide us it 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 blesses us with the beautiful environment the pleasing nature and many beautiful creatures around but human's greed is never satisfied and that's what it is said that it is enough on this earth for everyone's need but not for everyone's greed if you keep on exploiting the natural resources the environment then the day is not far that when it will be less sustainable for the humans and let's not forget that we are also sharing our mother earth with other living creatures and indirectly even we are harming them so let's take a responsible step and try to be satisfied and content with the available resources let's try to keep the nature the mother earth safe for the coming generations as well i hope now everyone is clear with all the facts which are related to the world earth day thank you for being so long